It's a little cold. Uh, first video, I guess, of the mini series or, or whatever you want to call it. But we are headed up to pick up my friend Dan, and we're going to go up to a uh, to our old school where we're going to machine down my rotors uh, for my CTSB big brake kit. So let's let's hit it. Above background while I'm in the truck, and then we're going to go up and get Dan. Um, but. So we're headed up to our school where they have a machine shop. The machine shop was built to make like uh, like katana carts and, and Baja cars and just smaller stuff for the engineering. So he was an engineering major. Thanks, Dan. Um, so we're just going up there and we're going to machine down the rotors rather than use a little Dremel tool. Um, not sure how I'm going to upload all of these videos. I might do day by day and what I do and then have a master one at the end where uh, if anybody finds it along the, the ways of, of searching for a big brake kit for a GTO, they found it. But that's the plan. That's what we're doing today. Um, probably gonna head to the garage afterwards and get that all figured out. How I'm gonna jack up the car and clean up the other side of the garage where my boat is. Um, possibly get a little heater. It uh, feels like negative 15 this morning, so good day to be inside, I guess. So uh, headed up to get Dan and then the uh, then the old aqua motor. I like the glasses. Very patriotic. Thanks. You're welcome. Explain anything to you? Yeah, just explain your process. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go behind and uh, figure out how to operate a hoss. Right now I'm putting some channels in place. Channels in place? For what? For bolts to go through and hold this. Okay. This thing. That, that fine thing? Yeah, your rotor. Okay. So what's that? This is a dial indicator that we're going to use to find center again. Until it touches? Yeah. I'm actually going a little bit farther to the old number that we did, which was 12 thousandths of depression. Did you secure loose clothing? Because you don't want that happening to you. This guy's getting sucked in by the machine. Oh, we just got to put the, the bit in, and then yep. we're, we're peachy. Very precise with that. That nice fingage. Thanks to Dan. Um, without him, wouldn't been able to do that. He's a pretty good machinist um, for what he uses. It doesn't have to use it every day, but when he does, he knows how knows how to use it uh, a lot better than what I would have been doing with a little uh, wire wheel and uh, or a little stone and, and grinding down this hub bore. So this is just a lot more accurate than what I would have been doing. Um, so he actually has a, uh, a Miata, and he has a little little build Instagram going on. So I'll plug it right here. And uh, go check it out.
and uh, maybe he has some uh, pictures of the uh, cart that he built for school. Uh, he did all carbon fiber suspension on it and, and tubular, carbon fiber tubular suspension. So definitely kind of cool. I don't know what I'm talking about. If you have any questions, ask him. So once again, Dan, thank you. Much appreciated. All right, so back at the, uh, the garage, I guess, goats in the background, um, able to bore out the, uh, the rotors to 71.4, just a little over a hair. Shout out to Dan. Thank you. I don't know how much of that video is uh, helpful. Say hi. No? So, got this whole thing to clean out and uh, threw a bunch of stuff away. Moved that over, put up some lights, and uh, be good. It's fucking cold. Um, so, I don't know how much we're going to do today. Forgot my bits at home, so I don't know how much we can do, but I definitely move the car over and jack it up. And I'm working on a decent trash pile from this. I'm just not using it and just keep putting stuff in it, so. It's fucking cold. And to, uh, to get a little propane heater. Yeah, now nah, all sold out. Whatever, it's not that cold. Uh, I got a jacket, bibs, and a uh, sweatshirt, and we're, we're peachy. He's got his jacket on. Don't like that. Your tongue will stick to it. Hey! So, uh, update you guys when everything's done, baby. <laughs> Freed up all that space. All that's on there. Um, yeah. It's cold. Start this up. Hopefully it starts up. I didn't bring a jumper pack or anything like that. Start it up and move it over. Uh, I have this little pole right here, um, so I can't move it over too far. But I'm gonna line it up with that. That way I have room to work on that side and this side, and a little heater up here. And um, I don't know when it's out, warming up. Probably end up installing the lights, but. That's it. Uh, just too cold to do anything else. Uh, no lights, nothing. Do get a sick table up though. So on that note, Monday upload. Check back next Monday. See what kind of progress we made. Um, gonna do one side fully of the uh, the brakes, then do the other side, and just do a mashup video with everything in it. That way. Yeah, you know, everybody's not watching through the vlog and, and figuring out how to do it. Um, on that note, I'll see you tomorrow. Maybe it's 20 degrees and not negative 10 degrees, but whatever. Um, see you guys next Monday. What's up, guys? Back again. Uh, next day, next night. Yeah. Uh, I had a bunch of stuff to do today, but we're back. Going to get the lights thrown up. Hopefully, take the... Uh, the wheels off the car and have a final resting place for the car so that uh, middle of the week I can come up and start start coming up and uh, taking off the old brakes and throwing the new CTSV brakes on but we're here not gonna stay too long it's already seven o'clock he'll probably throw another hissy fit here shortly um, got, his, got his bed efforts to make him a garage dog but anywho, we're gonna get cracking on the lights, gonna pull out the car, uh, throw the lights up, back the car back in, jack it up, and that uh, should be it. So, probably not gonna film a whole bunch, but just wanted to update you, cause you know, tomorrow is that upload, that Monday upload. All right, let's get cracking. All right, so, super jerry-rigged, cords everywhere. Definitely not finished. Uh, but that's the uh, that's the current situation, so I don't really know if I want to uh, go ahead and, and go with LEDs or um, or what. So we've got LEDs, and I would put that one over there, and this one over there, uh, and that would give us a ton brighter uh, area to work on. So I'm thinking thinking about that because I just don't think this is enough lighting. 
So on that note, thanks guys for watching. It's super cold out. Um, hopefully going to be doing at least one side of the car uh, with the brakes. Give you a little sneak peek at that. Uh, hopefully going to be doing that soon. Uh, probably Monday and Tuesday. And then once I figure out how to do it, I'll show you guys what I did, how I did it, uh, some of the things that I learned throughout it. So on that note, I'm going to go to work tomorrow. All right, see you guys later. Enjoy. Check back Instagram right right here. So, see ya. That's Maverick. Maverick says goodbye to